when Amy and I, right after we first got married, and um, she moved down here, and she was paying child support to her ex-husband, and then when her youngest daughter moved, decided to move from living with us to go live with him, well, our child support tripled. And we were paying more in child support than we were for the mortgage for our house. And after a few months, you go in the hole every month and having to take money out of his savings account to, to make up for that. And we sat down one night and we looked at all our finances and Amy was like, is the child support it? And I was like, yeah, that's, that's where it's going. I mean, we, we paid our tithes during that whole time, but we really, every month we were, we were going in the hole. And we, we prayed about it and just it was like well you know that that that's our part like that's you know that's just what we had to do at that time and it was only like a week later when Tom and Susie moved down here from Kentucky yes. and um, Rebecca Embry came down and we were moving Tom and Susie stuff into a storage unit and Amy and Rebecca were sitting in the back seat of the car and Rebecca says Hey, Amy, did you know that the child support emancipation laws in Indiana just changed from the age of 21 to the age of 19? I had to deal with that with a worker at, at work. And Amy ran out to tell me. And it was, God will change the law of the land. Amen. 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 He changed the law. He changed the law to give us, to relieve us from having to do that for two more years Praise because God. her oldest daughter had just turned 19 like a couple of months before and without Rebecca telling that to Amy we wouldn't have known wow and he will change the law of the land yes you he will you do your part Praise God. Wow. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God.